everybody, if you're wondering what the heck, my name is Bonobus Sparm Plays, and in today's video I've got for you guys is a GTA 5 uh, little patch uh, notes video. So guys, um, sorry that I haven't been able to get any videos talking about Heist. I'll uh, either get one up by tomorrow or maybe after this, I'm not sure guys, but... But, um, yeah, so let's go ahead and jump right into the topic. So, I'm going to be talking about the anti-cheat system, uh, the new anti-cheat system that Rockstar is adding into GTA 5 online because, uh, to ban just money glitchers, uh, modders, and hackers in the game. So, yeah. Now, th what this will do is this will put players into the cheaters pool, or this will go all the way up to console banning, or will be at the smaller bans, which is just like a GTA 5 online character ban. So, yeah. I think that most people who have uh, money glitched before this patch, <clears throat> or uh, maybe have money glitched on next gen, I think maybe people who have money glitched on next gen have to worry about it, I'm not sure. But, uh, I know that I think I'm pretty, I'm pretty 99.9% .9 sure that anybody who has money glitched before the anti-cheat system is implemented is okay because, uh, they will just be finding new people, uh, that are money glitching or maybe this could be a thing that's only for next gen. We never know. But, um, what this is going to do is if you, if I go on next gen or any gen and I say start money glitching to get $10 million dollars or something every five minutes what rockstar will do is they will take my account and they will throw me into the cheaters pool where i go with other money glitchers or i go with hackers and modders what this does is this allows me to get a higher chance of getting banned because i am playing with these people the best way to stay away from this is to and, and to get out of the cheaters pool is by just staying afk in a session just staying in your apartment not actually playing around and going and moving on with your day so you can pretty much get out of that uh, pool basically so yeah it's that's a pretty simple method but that's just what I would do because technically you're not interacting with these people you're just in the same lobby and you're not even doing anything now uh, since you're getting a lot of money 10 million dollars every uh, every five minutes you know that's that's a lot so you know you might go to the next step which is a character ban what that is is you have to if you have a level of thousand character on GTA 5 online what you have to do is you have to restart back on a level one character with none of your cars none of your apartments and none of your anything and that is a really annoying thing now if you're a hacker and a modder or you just do some really bad hacking like dns server codes which should be patched by now so you would get really big trouble for this you would get console ban which what happens is every time you try to sign in on any account on your xbox and or playstation I don't know what it is for PlayStation, but for Xbox, it will send you a message saying, sorry, but you are not allowed to play on this Xbox till 12, 31, 9, 9, 9, 9. What that means is that you are never allowed to get on that Xbox ever again, unless you cryogenically freeze yourself till the year 9999, 9, 9, 9, which would be pretty stupid. <laughs> um, but of course, I know that not many people are going to do that. So, um, yeah. Uh, so a few ways to get around this don't do glitch don't do money glitches just don't guys I mean I stopped doing these uh, a long time ago I think after I think even before patch 115 I stopped doing these um, because they just got a lot more difficult to do and they got boring because I mean buying everything in the game I mean it just kind of seems boring and stupid because there's no real fun that you get in the game I mean you only get the fun of buying those cars and customizing them but then when all the money's out you kind of you know you just get bored of the game again so you know i stopped and you know the game has been much more fun ever since i stopped because now i'm not worried about you know how much money i have much like i have fifty thousand left but you know i don't have that much and so yeah um so uh yeah guys hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video i'm trying to think if there is anything else of information that i need to talk about i don't think i think i hit it pretty well with the bat uh on here but other than that guys hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video go ahead and give it a like and a comment subscribe remember this anti-cheat system is going to be in place 
after the next DLC, which is gonna be heist, guys. So, yeah, guys, <clears throat> my next video after this video, whenever I upload it, should be a heist breakdown video where I talk about a lot of the heist stuff, guys. But hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a like, comment, and subscribe, guys. Make sure to follow my Twitter and stuff, guys. But other than that, guys, I hope you guys enjoy. Also, get me to 150 subscribers for me to do a gaming setup video and a bunch of that great jazz, guys. But other than that, I'm out. Peace, guys.